So joining us today is TJ Martinez, owner of TJ Clays, and she's here to tell us all about these amazing little holiday-inspired accessories made with love and a claytastic twist. <laughs> Thanks so much, TJ, for Welcome. joining us. Where do you get your inspiration for these earrings? Because they're so unique. I look at, I mean, even the keychains <laughs> with the little dinosaurs. Thank you. You are a student at Tamusa, Texas yes. San Antonio. Shout out to all the Jaguars. I'm also a Jag myself. So what is it like going to school? And then you also manage two businesses because you have a photography yes. business as well. I do. Okay, tell me about that. Um, so it is really time consuming, obviously, doing all those three things at once. Santa tasked us with finding three fun hot chocolate drinks, and there's no one better to help us than chef and author Cariño Cortez with La Familia Cortez. Thank you yes. for having me. What specifically makes this Mexican hot chocolate? I know you mentioned some tones. Yeah, so the cocoa beans mm -hmm. are from Mexico. That's and you mentioned that the frothier the better, right? Because it's a yes. tradition that it's good luck. Yes, it's good luck. It gives you magical powers and strength. While you're finishing up that, do you want to tell us a little bit about the Baileys? Unfortunately, we're under age L, so. <laughs> Santa won't let us. We okay. kind of told us no. That, so we'll have to watch y'all, and you'll have a lot of work to do. You two have found a TikTok trend involving a mask of sorts, right? Yes, we have. Correct. Yes, we have. And so the thing is, is when you have a mask, they're always sliding everywhere. And they big. never fit your face. <laughs> See, the, the trick is you have to adjust it. Right? See, it's like you adjust straps. it right here. So See that's that? where you cut it, mm -hmm. and then it comes up right here. And then you can just adjust it like that. You see? Okay. What do you think? Does Mike? that work, Mike? Does that work does, for you? Can I get some? <laughs> can I get some cucumbers from my eyes? I, I think so. Yeah. Let's let's do that. So is the TikTok hack Osterhage approved? Yes. All right. Okay. That's all we need to hear. This is great. Nice. Will it make me look younger? Um, we, sure. We can hope so. Yeah. <laughs> well, let's hope. <laughs> <laughs> and here to tell us more about it are two SA Live interns, yeah. Sarah and Lily. What'd y'all find? Oh. Yes, so the first deal we want to tell you about is a free meal for veterans. So on Friday, November 11th, all veterans and active military members can enjoy a delicious meal at participating Chili's Bar and Grill restaurants. Guests can choose an entree from a limited menu, including soup and salad, chicken quesadillas, boneless wings, and more. <laughs> the person you've been texting or calling for a long time suddenly stops. What is that called? Ghosting. Okay. Oh. okay. Today, we decided to start off the show with donuts. And so our first guest is helping us celebrate National Donut Day. And it's in a big or, shall I say, rather mini way. Joining us today is Celeste Steele, owner of Alamo Mini Donuts. Hi, Celeste. Hi, how are you? Fine, thank you. I'm looking and I'm in awe of all of these <laughs> different donuts. They look so delicious. Oh my goodness, just, just looking at them, my mouth is watering. <laughs> so do you want to explain to me a little bit about your business concept? Um, I know that y'all make the donuts fresh daily, right? Yeah. Our first guest today is on a new TV show and who knew baking could be so dramatic? She's here to tell us all about that and some of her amazing creations. Joining us today is Maite de Angel. Yes. So nice to have you on the show. <laughs> Thank you so much for having yes. me here. So I'm tell so me a happy. little bit about it. So it's called Bake It Till You Make Bake It, Bake It Till You Make It. It's a okay. new uh, docu-series. Tell me a little bit about my favorite here is a llama. It looks yes. so cute. <laughs> How do you come up with these amazing designs? So all these pieces are fondant and modeling chocolate. Mm -hmm. It's like choco clay. The detail is intricate. I, I was admiring it. It looks like a little figurine that you can yeah, find in an antique show. Well, it depends, you know, like like this 